Good morning. It's Thursday here in New York City and it's pouring rain and I'm on my way to meet a girl who I hit up on Instagram. If you watched my previous vlog, you probably know what I'm talking about, but basically I hit up a girl on Instagram. She also graduated from NYU and I decided to meet with her. I said like, hey, do you want to meet up? We've been following each other for quite some time, but never truly met, so yeah, exciting. not the best day to film because people are just angry and whenever they see my camera on they're just like can you watch that song stand clear of the closing doors please always prepared you never know who shows up around the corner maybe you know what's running through my mind how is it to make friends how is it to position myself so that I don't like come off as awkward or annoying or anything? <laughs> yeah, so I'm kind of anxious. Wait, is it here? Let me see. Yes, I am the person who is constantly late, I'm, like running 10 minutes late and I'm not proud of myself. But please believe me, if I tell you I'm not doing it on purpose or because I don't value your time, it's just sometimes I'm not very good at managing it, but I'm working on it. Okay, guys, I'm done. I wasn't able to film anything because I don't know. It's I feel like she wouldn't really like if I pull my camera, so I really enjoyed it. At first it was kind of awkward. I feel like I, people could sense that I'm shy a little bit, but over time it got very comfortable and I feel like we hit it off pretty well, so I hope she felt the same way too. Seems like she enjoyed it, but... Feeling alone and not having any friends in your mid-twenties is more common than you might think. When I moved to New York, I felt like I will have a lot of friends, a big social circle, but little did I know that seven years later, I still have no friends and no social circle. The more I do it, the more I realize that friendships should not be forced. Instead, I should just do what I do, do what I'm passionate about, attend events, continue going to dance classes, connect with fellow content creators, because naturally I'll find people who are also interested and passionate about the things that I'm passionate about and we already will have a common ground to connect on versus just hitting strangers on Instagram and hoping that somehow we'll click and somehow there will be something in common. I'm heading to David right now to come up from work because I'm nearby again. I'm like fighting for my life here with the umbrellas. You're just like, we're just like bumping. God, look at this. It's sore. Oh, of course. Something will be closed today and I cannot get there. A lot of biblical. You know what I think this hotel is? This is the palace hotel where Serena was staying. I feel like it was Chuck's hotel. Yeah, here's the palace where Serena was staying, by the way, so.